Hey everybody, welcome back to another uh, episode, another playthrough, uh, playthrough episode of Final Fantasy VI. Uh, we've gotten to Figaro, and we're, um, I guess, going to start by heading straight to the throne room. Alt. Oh, it's you. Proceed. Oh, they know him here. Storm in the castle. Please, hey, sir. You mean this young woman is... Is the voice I'm going to give him? Yes, it is. Who are you? Oh, my apologies. How rude of me to turn my back to a lady on her very first meeting. Did he do the Sonic? It's <laughs> funny. The young king of Figaro Castle, imperial ally, and champion of the technological revolution. Edgar. That sounds good. I am Edgar, the king of Figaro. Heh. <laughs> Surprised that someone like me knows a king? <laughs> well, I'll catch you two later. So you're an Imperial soldier, right? Don't worry, Figaro and the Empire are allies. Feel free to rest here for as long as you'd like. It's not in my blood to harm a lady. Why are you being so kind to me? Is it because of my abilities? I'll give you three reasons. First of all, your beauty has captivated me. Second, I'm dying to know if I'm your type. I guess your abilities would rank as a distant third. What's the matter? I guess my technique's getting a bit rusty. Hmm, I suppose gir some girls would have felt something from those words. But not me. At ease, gentlemen. You. Okay, so just doing some ch chest collecting here. Welcome. Oh, I can buy stuff. Better buy a couple of Phoenix Stones. Thank you. His voice is going to get deeper and deeper the each time I talk to him. Let go. Welcome. Okay, so I guess these are um, tools, but also weapons. Oh, are they from Magitek stuff? Okay, cool. I've got a potion and an antidote. Alright, one more screen. Uh, sure, I'll rest for a bit. I don't know if I need it, but we will see. I think I need to... I think there were stairs there. Oh, yeah. Okay. The pixels made it look kind of weird. Hello. Edgar has a twin brother, you know. He was such a nice boy, always thinking of his family. Edgar, what's wrong with that? Why is everyone taking out about or talking about a successor? Are you blind? Haven't you seen how thin this face has become? 
What do you mean? Edgar. 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 Are you crying? Oh, Edgar's twin brother who traded the throne for his own freedom. Sabin. Ah, oh, yes, Sabin. I'm sure he's a fine young man by now. He was just a boy when he left, even smaller than his brother. I often wonder where he is now, and what he's doing. Um, yeah, I wonder too. Oh, just, everything goes up to the rooftop and that's it. Out of my way, chocobo. Choco bitch. Alright. Uh, no. Back up to Eager. Well, how do you like my castle? King Edgar, there's someone from the Empire here to see this sire. Kefka, no doubt. Phooey, Emperor Gustav's stupid orders. Edgar, you pinhead. Why do you have to live out in the middle of a stinking desert? These recon jobs are the pits. Ahem, there's sand on my boots. Welcome, sir. Pathetic idiots. So, Kefka, what in the world brings you out of my way? You wouldn't be thinking of invading my kingdom next, would you? We have an alliance. An alliance? With this miserable little sandpit? Don't make me laugh. I heard you've been busy down south, taking over a country or three. Just what is the Empire up to? That's none of your concern. What brings Emperor Gestal's own court mage, Kefka, to my humble castle? A girl of no importance recently escaped from us. We heard she's found refuge here. This wouldn't have to do with that witch everyone's been whispering about, would it? Lies. She merely stole something of minor value. Is she here? That's a tough one. There are more girls in here than grains of sand in the desert. A man couldn't possibly keep track of them all. Oh, Edgar. You know you only stand to lose by trying to hide her from us. <laughs> I truly hope nothing happens to your precious Figaro. I didn't like the sound of that. Where's Terra? Take her to her room. I'd love to stay and chat, but the Chancellor and I have some planning to do. Being a king's not all tea and crumpets. Now you'll excuse me. Follow me. Oh, yeah, all right, okay. Sorry, I didn't mean to drag you around like this without giving you a chance to rest. I'm... Locke, right? Edgar told me about you. Is it true you're a thief? I'm a treasure hunter. On the surface, Edgar pretends to support the Empire. Truth is, he's collaborating with an underground resistance group called the Returners. I serve as their go-between. The old man you met in Narsh is one of us, too. The Empire, but I'm an Imperial soldier. 
Not anymore. They were using you. That's all. Things are different now. It's just, I don't know what I should do. Whenever I try to think, it just makes my head hurt even worse. All that matters is that you make your own decisions from now on. Try not to think too hard right now. You'll know what you want to do when the time comes. But how will I know which choice is right? What in the? Oh boy, he set his castle on fire. What's going on? It's the Empire, Kafka, he... What do you think you're doing? Bring me the girl, now! I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, then enjoy the barbecue. Hee hee hee! Get her ready. Yes, sir. Had a change of heart. It seems I have no choice. Or perhaps I do. Oh my, the brave and noble king abandons his people to save his own skin. How utterly delightful. Hee hee hee. Jump. All right, sink her into the sand. Yahoo! <laughs> oh, it's a moving castle. That's cool. Oh, it, it comes together. Figure out dive mode engaged. Witness the glory of Figaro. There it goes. Leaving Kafka in the, in the sand. It's not so fancy now. Go kill them! Ooh, a back attack. Howie. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna just heal. Oh, okay. Strikes all enemies with a spray of crossbow bolts used with tool command. Tools command. So you can do tools command. Feel better. What's the matter, Edgar? What made you jump like that all of a sudden? Did, did, did you, you would I just see what I saw? You did, right? Yeah, this kid's really something, huh? Really something? That was magic. Magic! M magic She used magic? Tara? Your name was Tara, right? What? What exactly was that just now? I'm sorry. I... No, we're the ones who should be apologizing. I didn't mean to make such a big deal out of it. Nor did I. It just surprised me. I mean, I've never actually seen magic before. Where did you... It doesn't matter, does it, Ed Edgar? Tara can use magic, and we can't. That's all there is to it. The fact is, her magic could really help us right now. Thank you, Locke. Thank you, Edgar. Swoon. <laughs> Oh, I thought I already used auto crossbow, but I didn't. Cool. Bravo, Figaro. He, son of a sandworm, you'll pay for this. 
That was great. Were those bad people? I'm... I'm scared. Terra, there's some someone I'd, we'd like you to meet. Like I told you before, we're members of the Returners. Would you be willing to meet our leader? Magic is going to be the key to winning this war. Magic? That Esper reacted to your magical powers. There's got to be a relationship. I don't know any more than you do. These powers just come naturally to me. But no human is born with the powers you have. Forgive me. What should I do? The Empire will com be coming after us. They want your powers for their own. And if they get them, the world is done for. Terra, you want to understand your powers, don't you? Then I think you should meet with Bannon. He may be able to help you find out more about why you have them. Please, Edgar's right. There's a cave just south of here that leads to South Figaro. Let's head in that direction. Direction. Um. Okay. This way? Ah, okay, I see. This way. Bye, Choco Baby. Not Choco Baby. King Edgar, where are you headed, sire? Through the cave and eastward to South Figaro. We'll then make for the Returner headquarters in the north. Return to the castle and pass the word along. Understood, sire. Take care. Oh, Guido? Oh, recovery spring. I thought that was Guido. These fancy turtles are very wise. Um, apparently, if I come back, the items in the chests will be upgraded. So... I can just go right through and not worry about it for now. Here we are in South Figaro. Green cherry. Oh, okay. So Chests don't change, I guess, but the the barrels and crates do outside. Figaro Castle stood up to the Empire? Great, now we'll all be drawn into the war. Sorry, sorry. This place is pretty beefy.
Ooh. Secret area. Is this like the dungeon? Do they keep people here? I mean, if it is, it's pretty nice. They got bookshelves and nice padding on the chairs. Five hundred gil. Ooh, a thousand gil. Empty. Ooh, fifteen hundred gil. Hmm. Were they organized? Oh, the clock. It's not ticking. Were they organized so that if you get them out of order, they don't give you the right stuff? Sandals. Hey, I needed a Phoenix Town. Cool. Oh, there's a secret. Another secret. This place is riddled with secrets. I don't like strangers. Bring me some cider and maybe I'll talk to you. Okay, I'm not going to get him any cider, but I'm going to go to the bar. Oh, is it Chocobo Stable? Here's the bar. Oh, you look pretty dark and menacing. Right, ignore us and maybe we'll just disappear. Back off, Locke. That guy looks familiar. He comes and goes like the wind, swearing allegiance to no one. Hidden behind his wintry gaze lies a face known to none who live. Shadow. You know, I think there are a lot of characters in this game, if I remember correctly. Just, like, learning about it. Yeah, that's Shadow, all right. He is an assassin. He'd kill his own best friend for the right price. Guess we'd better steer clear of him. Oh, so these must be the accessories. Okay, so sprint shoes are... Valuable, yes. Alright, so that was it for chapter two. Uh, thank you everybody for watching, and we'll see you next time.